Welcome Arithmetic Ninjas to multiplying a four digit number by a two digit number. Some people call this long multiplication and some people use a method called the magic zero method. So let's take a closer look. Now the first thing we're going to do is write the question out with the large number on top. So 4063 times by 14. Now normally you'd have more rows of squares than what I've got here. I've only got four rows of squares. Really you need five rows of squares for each question. And the other three rows are for your working out. So let's just draw some lines in here, giving ourselves three rows for working out. We'll set the next question up to. So 3138 multiplied by 12. And then we'll do our lines for our working out. There we go. Next one, 6221 times by 27. Do your lines for your working out. Need three rows of lines for your working out. Next one, we've got 1942 times by 58. Three lines for your working out. And the last one, 2507 multiplied by 82. Again, three lines for working out. Now we're ready to go, we'll go back to question number one. Now it's important to realise what your first line is for, and your second line and your third line. So the first line is going to be for dealing with this four, then the second line dealing with the one, and the third line we're going to add our two answers together. So on the first line we're going to do four threes, four sixes, four nothings and four fours, in that order. Four threes, four sixes, four nothings, four fours. Here we go. Four threes are twelve. Put the 2 in, carry the 1. 4 6s are 24, plus the 1 is 25. Put the 5 in, carry the 2. 4 nothings are nothing, plus the 2 is 2. And 4 4s are 16. Scribble out your carry digits because you don't need to use them again. You don't want to be using them again by accident later on. And now the second line is to deal with a 1. So you're doing one lot of everything but that one doesn't mean one it means 10 so to times by 10 we can put our magic zero in and then just multiply all the digits along the top by one so we're going to do one three one six one nothing one four in that order one three one six one nothing one four so here we go one three is three one six is six one nothing is nothing one four is four now on the final row we need to add everything together and that's because the top line is four lots second line is 10 lots and when we add it together we'll get 4 plus 10 14 lots which is what we want so 2 and nothing is 2 5 and 3 is 8 2 and 6 is 8 6 and nothing is 6 1 plus 4 is 5 final answer 56,882 okay question number two so we've got the top line is going to be for the two the second line is going to be for the one which means obviously 10 because it's in the tens column. And the third line, we're going to add everything together. So here we go with the top line. We're going to do two eights, two threes, two ones, two threes, in that order. Two eights, two threes, two ones, two threes. So here we go. Two eights is 16, put a six in, carry the one. Two threes are six, plus one is seven. Two ones are two, and two threes are six. Now for the second line, the second line is for dealing with a one, but the one doesn't mean one, it means 10 because it's in the tens column. So to times by 10, you can put your magic zero in and then just times everything by one. And that has the same effect as times in by 10 because you've already got your magic zero there. So we're gonna do one eight, one three, one one, one three. In that order, one eight, one three, one one, one three. One eight is eight, one three is three, one one is one, and one three is three. We don't need this carried digit that we used earlier because we've already used it earlier. Final line, we're going to add together the 2 lots and the 10 lots to make 12 lots. 6 plus nothing is 6. 7 plus 8 is 15. Put the 5 in, carry the 1. 2 plus 3 plus 1 is 6. 6 plus 1 is 7. Nothing in 3 is 3. And there's your final answer, 37,656. Question 14. Top line we're going to deal with a 7. 
Second line, I'm going to deal with a 2, but that doesn't mean 2, it means 20. And the bottom line, I'm going to add everything together. So the top line first, we're going to do 7, 1, 7, 2, 7, 2, 7, 6s in that order. 7, 1, 7, 2, 7, 2, 7, 6s. So 7, 1s are 7. 7, 2s are 14. Put the 4 in, carry the 1. 7, 2s are 14 again, plus the 1 is 15. Put the 5 in, carry the 1. 7, 6s are 42, plus the 1 is 43. Scribble out your carried digits because you don't need to use them again by accident. And now the second line is for the 2. But the 2 doesn't mean 2. It means 20. So you to times by 20, there's a little trick we can do. Put our magic 0 in. And then times everything by 2. And it will have the same effect having the magic 0 there as times it by 20. So we're going to do 2 1s, 2 2s, 2 2s, 2 6s in that order. 2 1s, 2 2s, 2 2s, 2 6s. 2 1s are 2. 2 2s are 4. 2 2s are 4 again. And two sixes are 12. All we need to do now is add everything together. Because the top line is 7 lots. The second line is 20 lots. Adding it together will give us 27 lots. 7 and nothing is 7. 4 and 2 is 6. 5 and 4 is 9. 3 and 4 is 7. 4 and 2 is 6. Nothing and 1 is 1. Final answer, 167,967. Question 19. We're going to do top line is for the 8. The middle line is for the 5, but it doesn't mean 5. It means 50 because it's in the tens column. And the bottom line, we're going to add everything together. So here we go with the top line. We're going to do 8 twos, 8 fours, 8 nines, 8 ones in that order. 8 twos, 8 fours, 8 nines, 8 ones. So here we go. 8 twos are 16, put the 6 in, carry the 1. 8 fours are 32, plus the 1 is 33, put the 3 in, carry the 3. 8 nines are 72, plus 3 is 75, put the 5 in, carry the 7. And 8 ones are 8, plus the 7 is 15, put the 5 in, carry the 1. But because we finished that along the top row of digits, that 1 can just go straight in. Scribble out any carried digits because we don't want to use them again by accident. And now let's go for the middle line. The middle line is for the times 5, but it isn't 5, it's 50. Because that 5 is in the tens column, so we're times it by 50. So times by 50, you put your magic 0 in, and then just times everything by 5. 5 twos are 10, put the 0 in, carry the 1. 5 fours are 20, plus the 1 is 21, put the 1 in, carry the 2. 5 nines are 45. Plus the 2 is 47, put the 7 in, carry the 4, and 5 ones are 5, plus the 4 is 9. Scribble out your carry digits, because you don't want to use them again by accident. And the final line is to add together our 8 lots and our 50 lots to get 58 lots of 1,942. So let's add it together. 6 and nothing is 6, 3 and nothing is 3, 5 and 1 is 6. 5 and 7 is 12, put the 2 in, carry the 1. 1 plus 9 is 10, plus the 1 we've just carried is 11. Final answer, 112,636. Last question, we're times it by 82. So the top line is going to be to times by 2. The second line is going to be to times by this 8. Well, this 8 doesn't mean 8, it means 80, because it's in the tens column. Then the bottom line is to add everything together. So here we go. Top line, we're going to do two sevens, two nothings, two fives, two twos, in that order. Two sevens, two nothings, two fives, two twos. Here we go. Two sevens are 14, put the four in, carry the one. Two nothings are nothing, plus that one is one. Two fives are 10, put the zero in, carry the one. Two twos are four, plus that one is five. Scribble out your carry digits, because you don't want to use them again by accident. And now the second line is the times by the 8. But the 8 doesn't mean 8, it means 80, because it's in the tens column. Times by 80, put your magic 0 in, and then just times by 8. And it'll have the same effect as times by 80. So magic 0 has gone in, there we go. Times by 8 now. 8 7s, 8 nothings, 8 5s, 8 2s, in that order. 8 7s, 8 nothings, 8 5s, 8 2s. 8 7s are 56, put the 6 in, carry the 5. 8 nothings are nothing, plus the 5 is 5. 8 fives are 40, put the 0 in, carry the 4. And 8 twos are 16, plus the 4 is 20. Put the 0 in, carry the 2. But because we've finished, that 2 can just go straight in. 
scribble out your carry digits and add together everything that's left because the top line is two lots the second line is 80 lots add them together we've got 82 lots four and nothing is four one and six is seven nothing and five is five five and nothing is five nothing and nothing's nothing nothing and two is two 205,574. Final answer. Now we've had a go at questions 1, 2, 14, 19 and 20. It's your turn to have a go at the ones that we've missed out. Good luck and don't forget the magic zero.